hi everybody welcome back for another video so let me kind of move this around so right now i will be showing you a flip through of the new planner that i bought whoops what is this i bought a new happy planner on the um the fall release from the happy planner and i was really itching to try this planner one well, give me a moment all right there it is so this new planner from the happy planner i don't know when it came out like this kind of planner like the twin loop but this one is from the fall release this is really bothering me by the way i'm not happy about this anyways i love this planner i love the detail i don't know if the camera picks it up but it's rose gold foil on the outside very like floral and gorgeous i really like that I'm not sure what this planner is called so if you know and you want to go ahead and let and tell me in the comments go ahead and do it all right you guys I don't use the happy planner anymore but when I saw this planner I wanted to give it a try I am not changing my passion planner but I want to find use for this one. I think I have something in mind. But that will be on a separate video when I'll tell you guys. But this one's really pretty. The floral sold me, by the way. Hardcover. Which I really like. Of course, the twin loop. Um, let me address the fact that I've never, I never buy twin loop planners. Because I am left-handed. My hand gets in the way. But I don't know. I feel like I'm past that now. <laughs> so, in here you have the page you know that it belongs to and you have the erotic glands i forgot to mention this is a um, classic size so you have the 2023 2024 and here you have the months i mean i don't know how the planner happy planner looks like but i think this is how it used to be back then but this is all right and in here we have um, January. I really like this. Again, I am in love with the f uh, floral and the um, rose gold foil. Very pretty. I usually go for the um, really simple and neutral kind of layouts because I feel like I can customize it a little bit more. So this is how January looks like. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but there are some tiny dots in here. They don't bother me. But just wanted to mention that I mentioned that out and it, they do have the holidays and here's the weekly layout again very pretty and neutral how I like it I'm really excited so you get a little quote down here not for every week but that's nice to see and then you move on to the next month now everything else is the same i forgot to mention this is like the monthly dashboard or whatever but i just i'm going to be flipping through um the rest really quickly so you guys can see how pretty um the monthly covers are so here we have february And here you have in the back like this really pretty page for you to like jot notes and whatnot whatever you feel like you want to do with that you can go ahead and do that but this is pretty much it i don't know my way around this kind of planners because I see that the page is kind of like i don't know just coming out is this normal i don't know if any of you like usually you use this kind of planners tell me if this is normal for this little thing to be like that or is it supposed to be inside i don't know anyways uh, uh i like the planner i think it's very pretty hopefully i can use it for what i wanted it <laughs> but i really love th this i love the detail on the inside very pretty all right thank you all for watching this video when the new year comes i'll let you know what i'll be using this planner for 
Thank you for watching. I will talk to you all soon in my next video. Bye!